Today's hero workout is Witten, and it's five rounds for time, 22 kettlebell swings, 22 box jumps, 400 meter run, 22 burpees, 22 ball balls. For the kettlebell swing, we'll deadlift the object up. We'll then hinge the hips, and from here we'll drive the object up overhead, finish the lockdown, the knees, hips, and elbows before returning the object back between the legs. If you don't have the space to go overhead, feel free just to bring the object up to eye line. And again, we still finish locked out the knees, hips, and elbows before returning it back between the legs. That's our object swings. Next up is our box jumps. So if you have a box, it should look like this, a double footed takeoff, double footed landing. We then stand ourselves up to knee and hip extension before stepping ourselves back down. If your object, you can't jump onto it, feel free to step up. You'll step up to full knee and hip extension and step back down. If you don't have a box today, you can go for a step forward lunge. So you'll, instead of box jumps, you'll just step forward, really touch the floor and then stand ourselves back up. Our next movement of 400 meter run. If you don't have a 400 meter run route, this will be two minutes of high knee. So you'll bring your knees up to a height you can maintain for the full two minutes. Next movement is our burpee. We start in a stood up position. We then bring ourselves down to the ground, shoot both feet out, hips to them touch the floor, tuck both feet back in, jump and clap. Or you can step yourself down, hips to them touch the floor, step yourself back in, jump and clap. Our last movement today is our wall ball. So if we happen to have a wall ball at home, we'll get ourselves in position, wall ball up in the front rack position. It's a full depth squat, followed by a throw to hit our target back into that full depth squat again. If we don't have a wall ball, it will be an object weighted jump. So you'll hold the object in the, in the front rack position. We'll then squat ourselves down and it'll be a small little jump out the top before sinking straight into that next rep. Be aware, these are super challenging. If they get too hard, we go for an unweighted squat jump. So it's the same thing. Now just unweighted, full depth squat, jump straight into the next rep. Guys, good luck. Enjoy. Let me know you get in the comments below.